My name is Jean O'Leverson Rourke, and uh, I'm in Madison, Wisconsin, and I've lived here, was born here and lived here most of my life. And uh, as you can tell from my last name, uh, I married someone of Scots-Irish descent, which is typical American, so to uh, marry into different uh, ethnic groups. Anyway, um, my father is from Stavanger and came over as a young man of 25 in 1920. My mother's family is from Trondheim, I believe. My mother did not have a lot of information, but her mother, she mentioned, was from Tron Trondheim, and her name is Matilda Olsen, or was Matilda Olsen, typical Norwegian name. And she married a man named Tobias Simonson, and I'm not sure if he was from the Trondheim area or not. Did they marry in Norway? Yes, they married in Norway, and I believe they came over in the 19th. 1860s or the 1870s, and um, there were five of them, uh, the two parents, and a girl who was about 12, and a boy four, and a uh, uh, baby, and I don't know if the baby was a girl or a boy, and it's really a rather sad story. The baby died on the ship and one of the parents died on the voyage, and the second parent died in New York. Mm. And uh, here the two uh, kids, 12 and 4, were in New York, and somehow the authorities knew to send them to the Midwest. And I believe the two kids were sent to Minneapolis or Minnesota anyway. And then somehow uh, they ended up in the DeForest area, which DeForest is a short distance from Madison. And, um, and my uh, grandfather uh, eventually bought a farm, a small tobacco farm. Mm -hmm. and lived in that area most of his life. Eventually he went to California, as did one of his daughters, and he came back to Wisconsin and died in 1945, I believe it was. Mm -hmm. And he had four daughters. Do you know anything uh, about your... Uh, if, if you have some family in, uh, in the Trondheim area today? Uh, I do not know anything about that. I have uh, uh, a cousin, he had four cousins, and there's one still living uh, in Stavanger. My dad's family came from Stavanger. Hmm. But your grandparents on your mother's side, you don't know nothing about? Know very little about yeah. them. I presume he was a farmer because he went into farming. Hmm. And that's about all we know. And I suppose he came to this country for greater opportunities. I think yeah. Norway was rather poor at the time. Yeah. There are a lot of uh, Norwegian people, American Norwegian people here in Madison. Uh, is there so that a lot of them doesn't know about their uh, heritage in Norway? Well, I presume that was true. Um, Though I think many people probably knew more than, than I know about my mother's side. Now, I know a lot more about my father's side, but mm. my mother's side, and of course, with a 12-year-old girl and a 4-year-old boy, mm. that uh, problems. Uh, my mother doesn't know what really happened to the 4-year-old brother. Mm. I guess he sort of wandered off. Maybe so, went to California, who knows. So you can have a lot of family here in the States that yes, you don't you have, don't know? Yeah, right, but yeah, I have a lot more family here than in Norway, I know that, yeah. yeah. Have you been to Norway sometime? Yes, uh, my sister and I went with the Sons of Norway group uh, maybe 22, 24 years ago, something like that. Mm -hmm. And we went to Stavanger. A lot of the people spent time looking up their family records uh, I do know quite a bit about my dad's family, so I really didn't need to check out the records of Norway. 
and we traveled around mostly going up the yeah. coast. Yeah. Were you thinking about your family in uh, mid Norway? Do I think about them? Yeah. Yeah, a couple of the couple of my cousins have come here. My uncle, who stayed in Norway, visited here mm -hmm. many years ago. Uh, the two cousins I've met speak very good English, so mm -hmm. I don't have to try to speak Norwegian. I'm afraid I don't know any. We always spoke English in our home. Um, if uh, if someone finds your uh, family traces in Trøndelag, would that be uh, nice for you? Oh yes, I would be interested in knowing more about my family on my mother's side. I would presume it might be kind of hard to trace with a common name like Matilda mm. Olsen mm. and Tobias Simonson and so forth. Two very common names, I think. 